Hey, Mayor Cooper and Chief Lauderdale, this is Jeremy with Friendly Mountain Fire Apparatus in Alabama. Gonna do a quick walk around uh, video of this uh, fire truck that you guys are interested in. Um, I just did a quick walk around myself on it and I'm gonna try to point out the things that I saw that are sort of the negative things on the truck. Uh, it's a 100,000 mile truck. It's got some things that are wrong. A lot of the things that are wrong we'll take care of. I'll try to point some of those out uh, as I kind of go around the truck as well. And I hope this video uh, is a help to you. Here we go. The paint is actually in pretty nice condition. Uh, it needs to be buffed out because it's been sitting here outside since we got it. But uh, you can see a little bit of my reflection maybe in it. Uh, a little bit of buff job and I think it'll be in good shape. Um, the interior, uh, here are some of the cosmetic stuff that we'll take care of. That needs to be tucked back in and secured. Uh, this seat bottom is just worn out. I pulled the truck around and I would try to get you two new seat bottoms on the front. Uh, 100,000 mile truck. So again, it's got some wear. We will take care of the upholstery that you see back there in that seat. Uh, I think the rest of them actually look okay. Maybe a little tear there on the bottom. That would be included in the price that we've discussed. Uh, you can see the speakers out of the microphone. We would take care of that. I also noticed uh, a couple little holes they've knocked in that. We would fix that in the price that we've talked about. I uh, got a couple of gauges I think that are bad. You can see this one's uh, got a broken indicator. We would include repairing that in the price that we've talked about. Uh, radio and speakers are missing and we would definitely put those back in for you guys um, at the price. Seating for five with four SCBA seats in this truck. Driver's side pump panel with two speed lays. Uh, when the truck comes to you, it would have all of the caps and plugs. Those would be installed by us before it comes to you. Uh, the pump panel is showing a pretty good amount of wear. Every single one of the gauges is low of oil and probably off. So we would just replace every one of these discharge gauges. Of course, you're going to get a pump test with it. Um, the truck doesn't currently have a deck gun. I would try to get you a used deck gun included in the price if I could, if y'all want that. Open the compartments here just so you can see. Uh, it's pretty standard amount of wear for a 100,000 mile truck. It shows some wear, but we'll clean that up uh, for you. The tires are actually really pretty good. Uh, it's street tires on the front and the rear, but there's definitely gonna be more than enough tread for it to pass DOT. Uh, kind of same thing back here. Show you that compartment. Rear discharge here, plenty of hose bed space, 
and actually your ladder storage and uh, pipe pole storage is in the hose bed so that uh, you get high side compartments on both sides. So you've got extra compartmentation. I think you can probably see the scene lights, uh, spotlights at the rear, and then pole lights here on the front. Uh, try to get you a shot underneath the truck. or sorry Tennessee so the uh there's just not really any surface rest or anything underneath and again front tires lots of transfer on those so those should be good federal Q in the front bumper and that's about it we appreciate very much the opportunity to try to help you guys. Uh, please let me know what questions you have about this truck and what else we can do to help you with it.